Okay. I think I did it. Nice. Ah. See, this is right. This is this works in my this works. And my subathon's still going. Hooray! Please do sub if you haven't already so I don't have to get a second. Why am I orange? Oh, because it's night light. There's a lot of reasons I'm, why I'm orange, but I don't, I, it, it's fine. I'm a pumpkin. It's Halloween. Good. Also, I can see this better. That was so muffled in my eyesight. God. <sighs> Hello, everybody. Ooh, me popping. Pop, lock, and drop it. Hello, everybody. Hi. Right now, I am removing sunflower... <laughs> That's twice I've done that. They've all stuck to the thing after drying them and letting them hang out. So we're going to toast these as soon as I, you know, get them oiled and whatnot. I have to remember how to do that. But we're also going to make some blueberry muffins. And then we're going to play with hair. Happy November to you. God, October is not my favorite month. Everybody loves October, man. I. <sighs> My favorite month. What's everybody's favorite month? I'll tell you mine. My favorite month of the year. Um, typically. Is May. May is my most favorite month. It's the last full month of, you know, until the summer solstice. And every day is brighter than the day before, and, or, you know, and it just, not brighter, but stays out longer. Um, but also, the weather, the weather's like just beautiful. April's beautiful because of all the flowers. I just love spring. Spring's my favorite. Summer's too hot. Winter, I don't mind winter clothes, but winter, just everybody else is kind of depressed. I'm medicated, so I don't usually feel it, but like, I don't know. I like winter because I stay up so late that the sun isn't coming up so soon. Good. Hunting. People love to hunt. I'm not a hunter. I like mushroom hunting. I haven't gone in years. Um, but yeah. Chris, you're back. What's your, what, what's your pain? Huh? <laughs> what? Oh, I didn't share again. I have to share. Maybe I'll be able to do this again. Yeah, everybody else is asleep. Oh, Rusty! We'll see. Oh. Okay. Try this again. Good to see you back, Chris. Thank you. Hopefully it wasn't too weird. Hopefully it just... It didn't, well, it did kick everybody off, didn't it? But thankfully there was only eight people here. BB again. What? You got muted for a reason. Next time, I'll can you. What the... What's your hurt? I have mentally or physically. I mean, emotionally. <laughs> you have to be a little bit more descriptive for me to give you a. I mean, I'm a middle-aged woman in the Midwest. You got to give me specifics to give you. <laughs> Hello, Christine. How are you? Oh, I didn't catch anything, because, uh, yeah. Hi, Nebraska. How are you? Hello. Hey, everybody. We're going to toast these after a bit. We're going to start up these muffins. I do have to look at the recipe for this, though. So. Oh, my God, I'm so thirsty. I just am so thirsty. Oh, that's great. Mm. 
emotionally. Well, hmm, that's my therapist's business and mine. You know, gotta go to therapy. Everybody should should go to therapy, but it takes forever because you gotta find the right therapist. <sighs> Funnily enough, I've been going to therapy since I was 16. Yeah. Still a little bonkers. It's fine. You know. Lo and behold, there's a lot of things that I have wrong with me, but the one thing I can say that I, I safely, I love has helped me a great deal. Being in love and being loved as much as I love is probably what has helped me the most and has allowed me to become um, more of myself and less afraid to be myself. I'm in the Midwest. I don't say exactly what state, but I mean, there's only a few states in the Midwest and, and you can pretty much guess, but I'll tell you. No, I won't. It's, you know what? If you go to my YouTube, I say all the time where I'm from. So there's that. I really, really want to. What? The? Those are lovely. Thank you. Firehawk, thank you so much. That was. I've never received one of those. That's great. I love it. I drove to Bushnell, Kansas from West Virginia to get a puppy. Ah. Cute. What'd you name him? Name her? Thank you so much. I had my, I saw that too, which was super exciting because um, I was looking at Patrick's pup. German Shepherds are cute. We thought um, Finnegan was part German Shepherd there for a while, but. Thank you. I, you know what makes them more intense? I, I so want to just wear them all the time. Can you imagine? It's my favorite thing to... <laughs> Those are so fun. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah, that. but that makes them intense. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I don't know how to make those. I don't mind them. This light hates, they hate the light, but it's, it's whatever. But yeah, I can see better because they're readers. But this old phone, I love my old phone. It's also a pixel. Um, it was a hard one to, um, read. What am I doing? Oh, toasted, roasted. Mm -hmm. Don't give me any special ways. I just brine them. I just want to put a little bit of oil on them and then pop them on the same tray. Recipes, no, don't care. Roast, I'm going to see it's roasted 15 to 20 minutes. We can do that. We can totally do that. For a carbon, okay. Not to try to ignore you. I just want to do the late, you know. Don't throw out the seeds. Da, da, da. Remove the seeds. Got it. Mm hmm. Large right, spoon. Ah, right, okay. Wash and dry. Okay. Season. Oh, she didn't even brine them. We'll create steam in the oven and prolong. Oh, is that it? That's fine. I don't toss the seeds in a bowl with olive oil. No, but uh, yes. Make sure to separate and breathe it. Okay. Roast. For how long? 350, 415, 10, 12 to 15 minutes. <gasps> Stirring every five minutes. All right, so we're going to do that. So sorry. I missed it. Oh, man. Woo! -hoo. This is.
those are lovely. What? No, I want waffles. <sighs> mm-hmm. Hey, appropriate. Thank you so much. I want to cook with... You are cooking with me. What are you making? I'm making this. We're in tandem. Do you have enough followers to do a live? There you go. I took my medication. We could probably do that. But, yeah. You could probably make something. It's only 2.18 in the morning. This is way earlier than I normally go on. How about trying to have a genuine conversation trying to shoot your shot? Bring something else to the table. I was a chef for 18 years. Nice, Patrick. What made you get out? Just tired? <gasps> way or Nosferatu. It's good to see you. I love cooking. We'll make garlic and lemon crusted salmon on the bay. I like kale. I like kale um, in my salads a lot. Especially if it's like a, a lemon and olive oil dressing. Like a fatouche salad type dressing. That kale is a great added addition to a, a big leafy green salad. I've been okay. Just doing the deal. Got burnt out on being in the kitchen all the time, seven days a week. Well, had strap! Been a while. Since I've seen... Aw, thank you. It's been a while. To, I haven't seen you in ages. Saute in a heavy... What? Arug oh, nice. I like arugula, yeah. It's so peppery. <laughs> I think I could learn a lot from you. Is that sincere enough? Thank you. Well, maybe. Maybe I could learn a lot from you. I just like being around, you know, doing stuff with my hands while I talk to people. It's what I do, at, you know, for my job. And I feel social, so this is what we do. Hi, Case Parks. I I don't know who you are. Oh, guys, I'm having a subathon. I would love it if you subbed so I don't have to get a, a second job. Thank you for the roses. Thank you. What kind of cookies have we made? Some burnt chocolate chip cookies. We're going to toast. If you're one. Oh, God. What kind of cookies? Maybe. Okay. Pumpkin seeds. I think we're we're nice and free. I think they're sufficiently dried. Um, I had to get them going anyway. But yeah, we'll start this. Okay. Popcorn? No. Maybe, maybe we'll make some cookies tonight. We'll see. I don't need them yet, though. I really, really, really want these muffins. Chips. Mm-hmm. Yep, but we are always making chocolate chip cookies in here. I don't know what my hair is doing. We're not worried about it. We can't worry about it because it's very clean. And if I wasn't, you know, maybe I'll take it down in the, if we go to the foyer, but I'm not doing it right now. So, that's what's happening. Did I, sh I did share this. Good. Thank you for liking the live, you guys. Thank you so much. Please do hang out, follow, subscribe, check out my YouTube. Um... I was wishy, I am going to be wishy-washy. I'm going to be wishy-washy about how many lives I can do. But, um, right now, we're just doing what we do. They seem to be doing okay, and we're just a little bit on edge, but we're doing okay. Aw, 
Aw, oh, thank you. Thank you so much, Strav. It's good to see you again. Where have you been? What have you been up to? Oh. oh I have to... Why? No, I didn't want to do that. Why did I do that? No, I don't want to do any of those things. I'm like, oh my god, no! <laughs> what? No! Why is this happening? Ugh. I'm spaz. Can't even expand my screen. Okay. So that lady says it's 350. The other lady said it was 375. I don't know. On the web. I can't remember um what I did last time I made these. So just I was almost at your but I didn't go because Oh, really? I'm sorry. That happened to me, actually. That happened to me before I bought my car. Hi, Mr. Patterson. I've been here at home with my... I've been in my dog nursing home. Very busy with the railroad and keeping up. Oh, I bet that's a lot. Hey, um, yeah, that would be a lot. For sure. I know that's probably not the easiest thing to do in the world. Okay. On a scale of 1 to 10, how much, how annoyed would you be if I used a microphone? Dakota! I'm in the middle of all of it. Hello, how are you? Learning to be a single father and mother is quite... Uh, I imagine it is. I can't, oh man. I could fall in that. My brain would just let me live like problem solving and I have no clue. Thank you. Thank you. Dakota, that was great. Thank you. Those, I know, I, I don't have a lot of goals. I'm just happy I got to see it. And I got it. Hi, Jim. How are you doing? Hello. Oh, good. What are we doing? I'm asking how... I, isn't it cute? I know. Um, how annoyed would people be if I tried to use a, what is it, a microphone? I just charged it because it died the last time when I was talking. It's going through a whole story, which I think it was the universe's way of saying, you know what, maybe don't tell your friend's business. <laughs> I mean, as anonymous as that was going to be, I just, I got it. It's, it's fine. And I need to do yoga. <gasps> Try it, dear. It's better to have small goals because you will get more gifts. I, I, I think so, too. We're doing okay today. I'm back in my kitchen, and we're doing, the, we're doing our deal. Everybody's asleep. There's a cat that we don't own hanging out. He, he decided that he likes spending the night here, so... He's got his chair. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. Okay. I know I'm forgetting stuff, but we're going to do it anyway. Can you just tell me? No. Okay, season of pumpkin seeds. I just want, boom, make sure to separate and spread the seeds. And lightly grazed, okay. See, I'm not even doing that. I'm gonna just... <clears throat> Try what, dear? Try what? But 
yes, Dakota, I think you're correct. Smaller goals does can lead to larger. I just, I, you know, it, subathons. Man. <sighs> Thank you. Oh. See? Thank you. All right, we will when we, we will. I just know that um, I have a hard time hearing, like when I put these up on um, YouTube, the sound is slightly lower, and this is up like all the way. I don't know why it's, it's a turd, but it is. So... what some people say goals like lions which is crazy yeah no treat others as you would like to be treated like it it feels better when you can gift like when you can make a difference in their gift like the galaxies I don't ever expect a galaxy so happy I almost completely recovered from that yay Good. Although I do, I don't remember um, what your surgery was. Oh my god. And we're out of salt. Might as well. We're gonna be making some. We're gonna be dirtying up some dishes. Dirtying up some dishes. Okay. Try the shoulder up. It's been a while. Oof. You have a great. Well, thank you. Thank you so much, Dakota. Because it's. It's easy. You guys make it easy. My moderators are really, I, you know, moderators are the best. I was telling my friend about it the other day. I'm like, I don't really see a lot of bullshit anymore. I catch it before I do because I'm always off on some tangent. I have um, hospital socks on. We're back to the hospital socks because it's getting cold out all the time. Why? Why? Also, I have no music going. What is it? What did you tear in your shoulder? Oh God, that is not there. I used to do this for the popcorn every night. Just take um, coarse sea salt and um, take it to a mortar and pestle and make popcorn salt with it. I know, and they gave me like Muppet feet. <laughs> I do. I totally have Muppet feet with these because it, it looks like, you know, I'm a Muppet. They're also very, very warm. And I have to have um, a, a size of shoe. Like, I got these accidentally. Um, these particular shoes once. They are too big. About a half size. But they're perfect for when I wear thicker socks. They're the best. Whew. Yeah. Baba? Let's see. Baba. Ba? What's going on? I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a picture of this cat too. This cat follows them on walks. I'm right here. Um, and it's really, really cute. But he lives like a block over. Why, why do I do that every single time? Calculator, camera, camera, calculator. Bye-bye.
His medicine makes him really thirsty, so. But also, he's very clumsy and he'll spill it. Bob. House is so drafty. I don't even know what that was. Um, sorry. Oh, man. Man. Jim, did you keep your, did you keep your socks? This is that cat right now. He acts like he lives here. Like, but how cute is he? <laughs> That's his chair, too. I don't know why he wouldn't keep the socks. They're the best ever, for especially for yoga. Oh my God, I don't want my bare feet on this. No. <laughs> I know. Super cute. So friendly. God, nope. But also, he hasn't met the other cat upstairs, so. He did make himself at home. He does every day. Well, okay, so the past two weeks, I think. He has a best bud, who's a polydactyl cat. That's who is home. That's who lives at his actual house. Um, He has a name, but it's not the same name we call him, so, but he comes to both of them, I guess. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. We're going to toss those and then put them in the thing. I've got to quit petting the dog before I start doing stuff. So, do you have any questions for me? Anything? I ran out of things to say. I mean, not really. I could talk for days about random shit, but We'll see. This is what. I don't know you. Stop crying. I have a grumpy 14 year old cat that tells me what to do. That's what Molly does. She's 14, almost 15. He's 13, almost 14. Thanks, Dakota. Yeah, she's the clock. Molly has a clock. She wakes up at 5.30. I'm also up at 5.30. And I'll take her out. Finn had an accident last... A couple... I, I'm sorry. I know. He had an accident last week. It's, it's a lot. Music, music, music. Okay. Ah. Battery 40%. Oh my god. Oh god. Cappuccino, cappuccino, cappuccino. Ba 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 ba. Ding ding. Ding ding. Pixel 3XL. Disconnected. Ready to connect. What? No, you are connected. Why are you being a turd? Connected to. Pixel 3XL. Also, why are you still loud? Ugh. It's a lot. You're being a lot. Okay. 12 to 15 minutes for that. Don't let me forget, please. And also, where, where? You need to stay. Trip up. Different one, probably. We'll do the lady, maybe. What's this? No, that's not it. This is a new one. Hey. 
new painting. Okay, ready? Oh. Six music with the blue hair. Let's see if it's good. It's been good so far. Everything that we've heard so far has been fine. So, um, yeah, we're going from there. Thank you for following you guys. Please do follow if you haven't already. Wow. <laughs> I don't know what else I want to put on these though. Not garlic salt, not onion salt. I just want them to be just salt and lovely. Yeah, okay. That's what we shall do. I'm nervous, can you tell? oil we don't need that kind of negativity in our life we're just using veg oil so we don't want too much of that sorry I have I definitely can't touch my phone right now what is this we are listening to it is it a station yeah it's on YouTube I know I know but I love YouTube music um, especially over Spotify oh my god um, and plus, I've had YouTube forever, so everything I've ever have looked up or wanted to listen to is already in that algorithm. I have two different algorithms because I use two different emails for stuff. If I want to reminisce about 2007 and 8, or when my husband and I first started dating, I just go to the other email. It's amazing. It's so great. So, yeah. And I could tell you what all that stuff was, but it was kind of obscure music anyway, I feel like. But I was basically, I had, you know, very diverse music tastes. That is still true, it's just very much true. I can't talk. Last. Okay. Oh my god, knock it off. Okay. I'm rambling. Oh my god. I always like how energetic and positive you are. Yeah, I don't use. But like, people on Reddit have been really mad about. Um. The ad blockers on YouTube Premium, or to make you do YouTube Premium. But I've had YouTube Premium for so long, it was like YouTube Red when I first got it and then it changed. I love having that. And I don't have Netflix anymore because I don't, I don't know. It's just not, I'm not interested in half the stuff that they have on there. Um, The only thing I remember like craving to watching was the Queen's Gambit and um, what's the other thing? Oh my God, and Great British Bake Off, but they're not on the, there anymore. So I used to use Pandora, but they started playing the same shit over and over again. And it, it hurt my heart. It was a lot, it was so annoying. That was for my take, but yeah, I used to have the, I used to pay for Pandora and that's what the salon that I worked at would, would use until some, somebody thought it would be cute to put Christmas music on in a salon. Now, I have a humongous, humongous aversion to Christmas music. Um, 
unless I'm playing it at my house while putting up the Christmas tree. But like, usually I just watch Harry Potter or something whenever I'm doing that. Um, it's gotta be like classical, like Tchaikovsky. Like I'll listen to the Nutcracker, all of the songs from the Nutcracker and it'd be amazing. But generally speaking, like I wanna, I, that's the music I play or I practice on the piano, but it's not, I don't dig. I don't want to hear it at work. I, it's not inclusive enough for me. Yeah. Well, that's what YouTube music is for me. Yeah, the Nutcracker Suite's amazing. I've seen it. I love the ballet. God, it's my favorite ballet of all the time. Of all. I know. It's the one I would go to. I'm not trying to pour all the salt on there. All right. Oh god, was this too much? Probably. It was. Okay. Too much. too much. We're going to have to um, wipe some of those transplants. They say you can freeze pumpkin seeds after you roast them and they keep. Whoa. Yeah, I, they, I usually take them to work and we eat them all. I went to the opera last year and it was a phantom. You know, I've never, I'm so weird about opera. I, I haven't found one that I, I enjoy. But I also, um, I'm weird about musicals. Like I, I went, I saw Le Mis once and I just, it turned me off from all, except for the only thing that fixed any of it was Rent. Seeing Rent. That's it. That's just so weird. I know. Musicals, opera. Ah, I'm such a curmudgeon. Ugh. Okay. I didn't think I would like it, but it was awesome. Yeah. I'm glad you, you liked it. I haven't seen... Like, we went to the... We saw the Nutcracker a while back, but that's the last thing we've seen of, of interest. Oh, I didn't grease that. Shoot. I overachieved insulting those bastards. So, we're gonna do that again. <laughs> Sorry. TikTok's been, um, I've been in trouble with the TikTok people because, oh, I got my first community guidelines violation, A, and B, I haven't had very many viewers. It's like we're starting, we're starting again because I don't do this enough. I didn't think, yeah. I think I did read that, Christine, about freezing this uh, pumpkin seeds after you roast them. I just... I can usually just eat a whole thing. Okay, what? Single layer. <sighs> Turds. 
Okay. I don't care. Stick to me as much as you want. So mad. I'm so mad that I oversalted these. But it obviously, par for the course. It's what we do. There's always something a little askew. Shit's burnt. Oversalted. Fun fact though, very few things are bland in this house. <laughs> so, that's the good thing, I guess. Ah! Man, where, what time is it where everybody is? That's not how you say that. That's not the, the front right, correct pronunciation. Elda. <laughs> Thanks, Lloyd. Lloyd Leggett. Legit. Be mutuals. Damn it. Man, I'm glad I don't have any cuts. I don't want to jinx it. I don't have any wounds on my hands where I'm touching all this salt. 246. Okay, same. Same, Jen. We're in the same time zone. And the day. No. I can't talk. My brain is going so much faster than my mouth, I guess. Surprise! Man. This sounds familiar. Nope, it's not the French lady. It's a pop. Oh no. I, you know what though? I don't really have insomnia. Like seriously? Okay. So I'll be sleeping down here tonight because um, it's my turn and I don't mind uh, sleeping down here. I told them I was doing stuff anyway. But like, um, I don't even hear. I'll be on the couch and they're going in, coming out, getting fed. He's making coffee. None of that wakes me up. I sleep right through it. I sleep like a champ. Nobody believes me. I just have different sleeping hours. So that's the thing. Welcome in, everybody. If you're new, thanks for being here. If you aren't new, man. Oh, all right. Man, what I could do is take this to YouTube. That would be fine. I go until I can't and then just crash. Same, Jim. Same. Um, it used to be I would fight the heaviness in my eyelids. I don't do that anymore. I'm like, oh good, I'm, I'm sleepy. I didn't recognize when I was sleepy. <laughs> I, I have no reason. I'm just like watching shit on my phone, which is part of the problem, I'm aware. But like, I don't know. Um, it was just weird. I can't remember anything I talk about. 
even if it's two minutes ago. I'm like, what are we talking about? <laughs> My train of thought, you have to kind of, you know, circle back with me because I can't remember half the stuff. Not that I'm, you know. What's great about that, though, is that I, it, I get to have new conversations all the time. Mm-hmm. I mean, it is. It's, it's a bonus, I think. Thank you for liking, Christine. Thanks for liking the live. Helps me get out there. But yeah. What is the thing? I guess I have to do the, um, what's, I have to show you this hair tool once I get the muffins in the thing. These are going to take 10, 15 minutes. I got to make the muffins and during that time. And then once these are cooling and the muffins are out, that's when we'll do the thing. The iron. Also, my foyer is super, super cold. And that's not fun for anybody. It's very stressful, actually. Hello. Welcome in. We're just de ah. salting sunflower seeds. No, pumpkin seeds. It's the fourth time I've done that today. Where's Chris? I don't know. He probably went to bed, actually. He's over on the East Coast like you, but he also, he's getting ready to go to work, I think. <sighs> Whew. I don't blame him. It is 2 thirty. What? What is this? What is happening? Stupid YouTube. Okay. What are we cooking? Right now, we're taking these pumpkin seeds that I oversalted and putting them on a different pan that's been lightly greased and all this. Just transferring over so I don't oversalt everything. And half of them is coming off of my hands anyway, so that's handy. But yeah. That's what we're doing. And then, muffins. Because I'm craving some muffins. I'll eat all those muffins, I swear. And if, um, I'm also craving chocolate, this devil's food cake. Ah, oh, what did I, I missed it? I always miss stuff. Thank you for following. How are the plants? They're doing okay. Um, I have a jade that's really upset with me still. And I've got a bunch of aloe that needs to be put in all the pots that I keep buying and never use. I want pasta. I want pasta. Kevin, I'm not your mama. I'm nobody's mother, except for Finney and Molly. But yeah, they're all doing okay. Every, um, I got a pitcher plant that's kind of upset that I she's very cramped, so I have to... She's one of Ursula's cuttings that I've propagated, and she's pretty happy. She's, But Ursula's given me new pitchers, and I barely fed her and um, Tiny isn't as happy with me because her container is a lot smaller. I won't neglect the baby boy. Well, Speedy, I've got you beat. Don't neglect your baby boy. Um. 
Yeah. God. Ugh. Slippery little suckers. Almost done though. Gosh, this is very tedious. But perfect for what we do. Hi, Bubba. How are you? Love the costume. Mm-hmm. What, what, what is this? Is this like... I don't even know. Doesn't matter. My everyday costume. <sighs> it's just my face. Okay. I do have a purple wig that I like to wear sometimes. But haven't worn in ages. All right, we're going to do some dishes. I fell asleep. Hey, hey, ow. Okay. Hopefully you don't fall in the soup. No more falling in the soup. Hello, everybody. Thanks for joining. We have a few more that have joined in. Welcome. I fell asleep on my glasses the other night and broke them. I do that all the time. I try to mend them back together. It's a whole thing. Oh my god. I really do hate it when I do that. I'm so sorry. Hello. Hi, Joe. How are you? I don't tolerate unpasteurized milk. I don't, I don't tolerate um, a lot of milk. But I drink it every night. I have cookies. I'm even going through a chocolate milk phase. I don't get the lactate, but I do feel better if I have, a, have the lactose-free milk over just like organic, but it makes a huge difference. Like I won't even drink, if it's not the organic milk, like there is something different that happens to my body when I have organic milk versus like the everyday stuff. I didn't realize that people with ADHD had so many uh, tummy issues, but it all makes so much sense now. Now I just hear Arthur Morgan say that. Okay. Cows. Grass-fed is more tolerable because they eat what causes... Huh? Yeah, right. Like, um... No, I haven't. I know you are. I don't I don't know how Good slow night at work. Good. Cream corn. Yeah. I didn't do any of that at Christmas. Oh, no. No, I saw that. Ow. He woke up. Hello. Oh, yeah, that's right. Coma gem, that's what he's talking about, but on that same, um, on the topic adjacent to that. <laughs> uh, we're talking about how uncultured so many men seem to be. It's like they forget to act. They're like, oh, it's anonymous. You're right. But what's funny to me is that, like, it's like people don't know. They don't know. What's the next step? I want to know what your next step is. Because let's say these, you know, 
I don't know. It never works. But what if it did on somebody? What's your next step after that? Like, there's no... It's just dumb. It's ignorance because you have nothing else to give. Yeah. Fifteen minutes. Check them in twelve. Okay, what are, timers, clock, how dark is it, pretty dark, yeah that's fine, after I'm done I'll be looking at your wish list, aw, thank you, I need to work on it again because there's bunch of stuff and now the TikTok shop thing god those things are super cheap although the problem is is that you don't get them for like two or three weeks if I had a little bit more money the first when you first order stuff things are super cheap I had like 10 things in my cart trying to do the TikTok shop thing because everything it was so low Twelve minutes. I said fifteen earlier, but we don't want to do that. Hello. Okay. Next. You know what? Yeah. Okay. Snack break. So. Also, I have a lot of popcorn. Mmm, popcorn balls. Still good. Hello, everybody. I make popcorn on the stove all the time. Please visit my YouTube. And you'll see me do it. Mm-hmm. But, yeah. Microwave popcorn is fine because it's already in a bag with the Nesquik. But this tastes better with it, with Nesquik. I just want it plain all the time. What, what about positive? Am I not being positive? I am kind of curmudgeon me. Curmudgeon-y? Mmm. Goodness. doing okay Everett how are you yeah we like the positivity in here for sure man I don't know what grocery store you have around you, but get the white corn. Popcorn's great. And this was made, I made it yesterday, last night, I guess. Hmm. Man. Sabathon.
Nice. Well, welcome. It's good to have you. <laughs> yeah. Puns. They're so funny. Yeah, I'm not clever enough to think of a pun like super fast. That was good. But I do enjoy reading that. That ship brings me joy. Who doesn't want to read that? Mm. Kernel of truth. Okay. You didn't come here to watch me snack on pop. Okay. Mm-hmm. And I have to be reminded of that pretty frequently, Jim. Actually, God, I have some frozen custard in there that I really want to bite, too. Mm-hmm. Definitely wash my hair today. It's fine. It's fine. you. Man, that is so nice. Oh, God. That's amazing. Do we have a cat? Is a cat out? Like, we have a lot of cats, I guess. I, we have one upstairs. That's my husband's cat. He should be asleep. But I thought I just heard him. And then we have a chatty cat, but he's, like, passed out in his chair. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, and knowledge is power, for sure. I feel like you're stalking me. You guys. Seriously? Ever, that would be amazing. That's what I was saying earlier. It's like, I did the... What? Who did I invite? Did I invite somebody? I didn't mean it. God dang it. I don't know what I did. Thank you, Jim. I didn't mean to do it thing I was going to um I was saying about how I'm doing a subathon because I need subscribers but I'd be happy with YouTube subscribers um so I don't have to get a second job oh are you are you calling me Barbara crunchy no, I don't know who you are. Barbara. <laughs> nope, people call me Knock Knock. Who's there? Okay. So. Nothing makes sense. Mm. Put this back in the shaker. I guess I could do some. I'll be fine. I'll be fine, you guys. You get what you put out. Yes, the niceness and positive vibes the best. Thank you. But sometimes... that Yes, that is very true. Um, but sometimes people will see... Someone being nice and think, oh, I'm going to shoot my shot. And then they become very persistent. And it kind of ruins the vibe. That's been a thing. <gasps> Apple tree, where have you been? I haven't seen you in ages. Totally, they both rock. Bobby and Everett. Thank you. You guys are great. I wish I could see this. What are we listening to? Why did you pause? Don't pause. Bubba, do you need to go outside, honey? You guys, I have to carry him up the stairs. Oh, good. That's uh, two years but right before I moved in here. Are you trying to... Also, we rent, so... 
Is that your attempt to be rude? Or are you trying to make me feel any kind of... I don't know. I don't know how to feel about that, but it didn't seem like it... There were, your intentions weren't clear. 2007 was a wonderful year for me, so... That's the year I moved in where I am, so that's the year that I met, that I started seeing my husband. 2007, I'm not mad at 2007, and yes, these cabinets are very colorful. The outside of my house is very colorful. I wear a lot of black and gray. <laughs> yeah, 2007 was a wonderful year, actually. I hate attacks on myself. Yeah. It isn't like yours. You shouldn't like <laughs> mine. Yeah, no, I, I think they were just trying to be funny and then they suck at it. So they failed. Emma. Oh. oh well, it's okay. Making cookies, but it wasn't funny or even clever. That's right. But it did make me reminisce. We have to look at the positives, right? It made me reminisce of the positive things that happened in 2007. If it was 2008, 2008 was also a very good year that ended poorly, but kind of not. <laughs> that was, that was a big, that was a big year. You take care. <gasps> Thank you, Everett and Bobby. Thank you. Good to see you, good to meet you. I'll see you around. I'm usually here at this hour. Apple tree, you have twins? Yes, thank you for being so kind. Oh, whoa, genuine antiques. I, I love antiques, but also a lot of them might be haunted. Oh man, they're they're teenagers now. Oh, oh man, oh man. Do they have their driver's license yet? I'm so scared for you. Okay. You guys, we have to do the mixing. We're gonna mix. <laughs> Why is everything stopping? Can we talk about it? Do you want to talk about it? No, I don't. Okay. Can I turn that off? You stop. Oh, that's why. No. Okay. Okay. It doesn't help a lot, but it helps a little bit, and I have to stir these. Okay. Now that's a fridge. Yes. Oh, yeah. I, I would take you closer, but there's a lot of photos of my husband and I on there. But I'll show you my favorite sunset photo I've ever taken. On my 2000, no, I don't know what razor phone it was, but I had a photocopy printer and this was so lovely. Can't really see all the colors, but yeah, that it's very much, it's more vivid than what you can see. That was in Panama City Beach in 2014. What phone did I have? That was a, that was a droid, that was a razor. And then, this is over by my work. The sunset photos were always amazing. I wish I could show you. But yeah, the beautiful colors. Main bust. Yes, I know, okay. Directions, I have to have directions. Supposed 
too. Ooh, these smell good. Oh, please. Do I want these? <gasps> no. Melamine. I love me some melamine. Was that? Yes. And we're going to use a Jiffy Mix because that stuff is so delicious. It's sweet enough. It's not overly anything. It's just delicious stuff. Yep. Oh, why are you popping? Pop, pop, and drop it. Okay. Are nowhere near toasty. We're going the full. We'll probably go another 10 minutes. Checking after five after this. I did brine them for a super long time, so I don't know. Knock it off. Missed it. Where do I look? Five. Okay, that was good stuff. Oh, what happened? Oh, sorry about that. Hey, everybody. Sorry. We're gonna make some muffins. Made in Chelsea, Michigan. I used to live there. Oh. Yeah. Um, my husband is from Kentucky. Um, but I grew up on, like, Jiffy corn muffin mix. And he, he kind of snubbed his nose at it at first. But he likes the Jiffy. He was all like, you know... We have to do it with the Martha White, this other stuff, and it's a hot right. It was bland in comparison, so yeah, Jiffy's better. Jiffy cornbread is amazing. Star Smooth! Yeah. Um, like you want to have it the authentic way. Honestly, that's the only time I like corn in the cornbread too. But that's real, that's real niche. Like I never see that out anymore, ever. I like mine sweet. He likes his more of like a pancake. <laughs> Whatever. We're gonna add blueberries to those. Cornbread is so good. Yeah. I have this vegetarian version, but I don't know if I'm. <sighs> Jeff Daniels, the actor, lives in Chelsea. Oh! He wasn't in terms of endearment. I know he was in Dumb and Dumber, but like he wasn't in terms of endearment, right? Why am I confused all the time with that? This is the song I liked. Sat next to him at a band concert. Nice! Yeah. I oversalt the shit out of everything. I can't, I'm not allowed to make like the mashed potatoes for a big family function ever again because I oversalted. Overachieved. It's fine. You wanna see my house in a shambles? Yoga mats because they can't get traction on the floor. Yeah, 
Those um, yoga mats were like six bucks a piece. I don't need them to be cute. I need them to be functional. Good, she didn't walk on his head. God, she's such an asshole about it. She just walks on his head all the time. Ugh. Lost a bunch of weight. Listen. You gotta be careful of overeat. Whoa. A shambles. It is a shambles. I think he wasn't. Nice! See, I could have looked that up. I just, you know. Thank you for following you guys. My goodness. Hi, Ken. I hope he's still here. If he's still here, I, I miss everything. Okay. Okay. Now we gotta wait for these bastards. They're almost done. Function serves me better than pretty. At this stage in our, in our lives, it's like we don't really have a lot of people that stop by. We don't have family coming. We don't, we're just on our own little island and people that do come over, they usually just come to the front of the house and that's where they stay. Unless they're, you know, close friends and then I allow them to come back here. But like, I don't know. Like I don't, it excites Finn too much. He still thinks he's a puppy. And it, he, his body doesn't work like his mind works. We can't talk about it anymore. Bye for now. Good night. Have a great rest of your day. Happy Wednesday. Sorry. I'm trying to go grocery shop. Grocery shop when I'm hungry all the time. I ever since I had COVID last year. This time last year, actually a year ago today. Um, it was so dumb. I haven't been hungry for anything in particular ever since. Hi TS, how are you? I'm really boring. I'm really boring. Leap lurp. What, what, what did he say? Was he trying to be mean? Yeah, yeah. I'm so glad somebody else gets that. I'm like, I, it's not, I'm not trying to be cute. I'm not trying to have like an Instagram like ready house. I live here. I don't care. Am I comfortable? Are my friend, you know, are they comfortable? Is my husband comfortable? Do I feel free to let the random cat come in on occasion? That's where we're at. I don't need it to be cute. Of November? You're a Scorpio. I got a new vibe from, yeah. Ooh, these look nice. Ooh. I'm mod for hundreds now. close I have to get in order to read that properly oh my god it changes everything <gasps> I don't know what that means but I love that you do you probably do mod for like a, a thousand people oh the world defender I, we gotta try that hair tool seriously I love that this sounds like popcorn when it pops I think these are done. We don't want to burn them. Ah! Yeah, lots of weirdos out there. Yeah, but, but you know what? I have the best mods. I mean, they put the kibosh on it so fast. 
And I've got a bunch of them too. Because you never know who's free. You don't want to bother anybody. I have to work on asking. But yeah. I'll tell you. They do a great job. Um, what is the other one? But, you know. Sometimes I catch stuff, but most of the time I don't. I don't, they don't even, they get it before I have a chance to even get my feelings hurt. Because that happens too easily. have a two minute timer. It ain't hard to act normal or be nice. Yeah, they don't. They do not act normal and it's just way out in left field. I just can't stop analyzing like what's your next plan after that? Mm-mm. Yeah. Nope, it doesn't need. They, they can be normal. I do have. Like, I do appreciate that the DMs that I have on here are already separated from, like, only people that can, that I'm friends with actually can. Well, that I think that's a thing. But there's been other things that were changed. And I like it. <clears throat> Just like eating in sunflower seeds. Hello, Mr. Top Ramen. Happy Halloween. Happy half price candy day. Yeah, those are perfect. Right there. <clears throat> those aren't over salted and they're so good. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. No, Philip. Super happily married. I've been with the same gentleman for a very, very, very long time. They're done. All right, we can move on. Cool. It's a box, say. Thank you. Box. 400. Jeez. Oh. I really love these. What? Oh God, what? What happened? Hi Grace. Mm -mm. No, Chris, because you have more to bring to the table. Mm, they don't. That's Jim. Yes. My mom. <laughs> what look was it? That's funny. Look up sapiosexual. Okay. My medicine's wearing off. But these are really, really delicious. I'm so glad. They're so hot. Okay. You gotta make the things.
I have so many things I want to say to that, but sure. Go ahead. You can ask me something. Hmm. Hold on, I gotta think. What genre? Are you just talking about anything? Um, Me Talk Pretty One Day by, um, Oh my God, David Sedaris is one of my favorites. Fire and Blood. George R. R. Martin. I read all of Game of Thrones stuff. House of, no, Fire and Blood. House and Dragon? No. Whatever that book is that told the Tar Targaryen story. I have that. That was great. But yeah, uh, fiction, probably some George R. R. Martin. I also don't expect him to get anything done. I don't expect him to finish it up. Um, but I also never read any of The Hobbit. I bet I would like it if I, if I did. I don't know. We're making muffins. We're making muffins. Johnny. <laughs> My favorite book is A Bag of Bones. I read a lot of Stephen King as a kid and I shouldn't have. Like I read it. I read, what? what is it? Misery? I shouldn't have read that. <laughs> I think that's why I don't like scary shit now because I'm like, Bleh. I read it all too young. I didn't really have a lot of... I was grounded a lot, so I couldn't watch TV. Uh, so I listened to a lot of records and uh, read a lot and read books I shouldn't have. I just think grounding for my parents was just super the laziest of ways to parent. Because you're not doing anything but just like... Oh, she's upstairs. She can't go anywhere. We don't have to worry about her. Yeah, yeah, he does. Whew. I've gone for 90 minutes. Nice. I don't want to take a break right now. I haven't been on for a very, very long time. <laughs> oh. Oh, did he say something? A oh, way to enter a conversation. What? I thought it was a nice one. What happened? Oh, I don't know what he said, though. I, I, I know I repeated it, but I don't know. Weird one. Mm -hmm. 
records. Nice. All the records. Oh my god. But sadly, I can't tell you. I mean, I can tell you. There's a lot of sticks. There was a lot of... Like... I feel like knowing... I had a favorite side to tubular bells. Gary Oldfield, right? Yeah. Side B on tubular bells, where the exorcist song is, is so much better. Like I learned what all these instruments were. A harpsichord sounds amazing. <laughs> I don't know. Mandolin, sounds great. I didn't know what those sounded like in particular, so it, it was so great. My mom had a lot of records, but I mostly listened to cassettes and CDs. I was an 80s child, same. I grew up in the 80s, right? So it's like, I was born in the 70s. But, um, yeah, I know I was pretty young when I memorized all the words to, I, I memorized all the words to Stairway to Heaven before I memorized White Rabbit by Jefferson Airplane. And there's no words to Great Gig in the Sky, but I could go note for note. And I can go uh, note for note with uh, me and Bobby McGee, Janice Joplin. I never read The Hobbit. It was, it, I always felt like all the smart kids all read it. I didn't ever read that. We're never gonna get anywhere, you guys. Way before they made it into a movie. Instead, I was born Aw, so is Taylor Swift. Nice, thanks for the follow you guys. Greatly appreciated. I am so excited, I have another subscriber. That is wonderful. Baby, baby. Although, I got, I was also a baby and I got caught up real fast. where I was the first time I heard um, Smells Like Teen Spirit and how the first time I heard uh, Violent Fins, how where I was, what I was doing. I remember the video to Mazzy Stars Fade Into You and uh, Red Hot Chili Peppers Breaking the Girl because it was on MTV right before I went to school. So great. A wide array. If you guys wouldn't mind if you could share this while well, I'm still on here and I'm making muffins. That would be amazing. I hate asking. But I'm gonna Breaking the Girl is one of my favorite 90s songs. Yeah. That video though, good. that video was great. My doctor liked the Hobbit so much, he got Hobbit home. Man, I couldn't ever decide on that tattoo. I was always so jealous of people who could just get tattoos and be like, nah. I know you can just burn them off now, but I'm such a chicken, ugh. But also, why can't they do, can't they do that to the face? Okay. I wonder what he got, though. Now I'm interested. I only got two tats. I have a belly button piercing, and that's it. That's all I could do. Here, in the ears. <sighs> I'm a clean canvas. Yeah. Both Cherokee. Nice. Um, my husband has, um, I don't know what his meant, and his is kind of faded now for life. So that's a choice you've, you've made, right? All I knew is that I wanted to get a tattoo and not have it outlined in black. I just wanted it to be like 
I wanted it to be like a girl I used to work with who had the most beautiful, beautiful tattoos I've ever seen in my life, but I didn't want any black involved at all. I wanted to pop like pastel tattoos. Rumor has it, that's precisely what Dolly has. That's why she always wears long sleeves. She has these beautiful pastel tattoos on her arms. Nothing surprises me with that woman anymore, but if she does have it, amazing. If she doesn't have it, also fine. As long as they're talking about her, she's irrelevant. Okay. I would love to see those tattoos. Like frescoes, but on your skin. Yeah. Thank you for sharing. Yeah, we're in there. We're in the place. Everybody else is asleep and it's only 3.44. Guys, it isn't 5.30 in the morning. I know. That's why I haven't had any. But also, right at this point in my life, I couldn't afford it. And I was an idiot. So I would have been super pissed if I still had something... Um, on my skin, oh. like I don't mind my belly button piercing. I got that right at 18, but like, <sighs> or to make what you got better. Yeah, no, I don't have any of that. I don't have any money for anything, but I want the art, but I'll just admire other people's art. I could never decide what I wanted to get. Yeah, me neither. Ugh. I can't believe I have to get a new script. Whatever, we're making muffins. We're making muffins. This is my favorite trick. I swear, I'm obsessed with it. <laughs> oh, isn't that a tribal though? Ooh. I want to show you this cat, but I, and I can pick him up and he's super sweet and everything, but I don't want to make him upset with me. I don't remember his tattoo. What's your favorite Halloween candy? These pumpkin seeds are amazing. I'm so glad I brined them. Mmm. Lies. No flipping way. Mm -mm. I don't believe any of those. I have to stop doing that because I'm obsessing over it. Sorry, 
Can't stop eating that sweet candle wax candy corn. I can't deal with it. I cannot deal with it. You know what I miss? I think I've got my thermostat up to I am roasting. Yeah, you better turn that down. You won't be able to sleep. I sleep better when I'm cold. We like this one. I need to make tea. What are you making? Hey, Crypto Daddy. I'm gonna, I'd rather sleep. Yeah, right. Me too. We're gonna be making some blueberry muffins from a box. Adding extra blueberries. More blueberries. Uh, real blueberries to go with their blueberry flavored particles. I know you're supposed to split, like, put the, so I like the aluminum ones, right? And these are, the white ones are supposed to go inside of the thing. I don't do that because I like mine. Like, these are just fine. So that's what I use and it's my favorite. Because I feel like we get a twofer. We get twice as many for the same price. Hi, I'm gonna listen while I do a little work. Ladybug. Perfect. That's what we're doing. We're just hanging out doing stuff. Please do follow and subscribe if you can. That's where we're at, what we're doing. I'm having a subathon. It is. Ladybug toast. I think I need to lay flat actually, but we'll see. I didn't put that back where it goes. I don't know if anybody really cares. Hey! I wait until it's really, really cold and start up the fireplace. See, we have, an, we have a gas fireplace and our gas company is like a monopoly, so it's like, no, no, we can't have it. I'm over this. This has to go. Sorry, mortar and pestle. Okay. Okay. Yeah, the utilities here are in Monopoly too. I hate it. I hate it so much. I'm listening to Kim Carnes now. What? What's Kim? What is that? Who's that? I'll have to. Okay. Screenshot. Pro propane way too expensive. Hello, pretty lady. It's all, is food almost done or not? Were you here before? We're starting new stuff. We're making these. We just finished these pop pumpkin seeds. Perfect. 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 Hmm. God, those are so good. Mm-hmm. Roasted and salted. Mm-hmm. Nice. I don't think it, it's supposed to be a rainy winter, but cold, but not snowy. La Nina, I don't know.
Okay. What? Milk? Mm -hmm. I don't... I'm very... I'm stranger danger. Okay. Roasted and salted is the best. Although I do like some brown sugar. <laughs> Ow. That one got caught in my throat. Alright. I bet they'd be good with some Nesquik on them though. My first concert was New Order. Goonies. Never say die. Did you see that? Who was the brother? Who was the older brother? He dressed up as himself from the Goonies for Halloween. It was, it was so funny to me. What was it? What? He's a Brolin, right? Josh Brolin? Yeah. Was he the one that, the older brother? He... He dresses this character from Goonies, and I just thought that was so perfect. Why I said I should have been born 19 Miss. Oh. No. But, like, you probably... I don't know. Sometimes I wonder... Oh, my parents are. My, yep. Yeah. Quarter of a cup of milk. Heavy cream or milk? Butter milk? No. Milk. God, I'm a mess. You can't take me anywhere. I'm just gonna slam all the things. Okay, real question. Lost Boys or any movie with Kurt Russell? Overboard was a pretty good one. I love Overboard with him. I I wish I liked The Lost Boys more, but I got bored with it. Yeah. I don't know, and it sucks because I hate saying that like out loud because I feel like it it goes against my culture I don't know did I do that right fine hello atomic how are you doing my parents were born in the 50s yeah same overboard was so good and that's where he met Goldie or you know that's when they got together How are you doing, comic? What's going on? I just still like calling you Vandal. I know that's not what you want. I just... It just brings me joy. Change is hard. I feel like I'm not doing things right. I'm doing it. like I have a neuroses and it was fine I just set it in there but it was in the sink so I have to rinse it I wasn't impressed with Roadhouse I wish I I wish I liked it more I just get I'm gonna go back and forth him and Goldie Hawn I know it, it makes me happy that they're together Everybody, 
please do follow if you haven't already and if if I would love it if you subscribed I'm doing a subathon and also I have a YouTube if you like YouTube a lot of people are mad at YouTube I am not I'm a I like the YouTubes <sighs> I knew having a blast. What have you been playing? It was a movie where Cher was a witch. The Witches of Eastwick. I love that movie. I love that movie. And what was the one where she and Winona, Winona Ryder was her daughter? And, they, and she, Cher was a bad mom. Oh, but Cher was a good mom and, and Mask. That was, that still, oh my God, such a good movie. God. What are you playing, Vandal? Comic. Vandal comic. Here. Mm hmm. Thank you for the follow. What? I have a. What? Oh no. We don't. We don't. No. I'm very. It makes me nervous. Watch it and oh, I know I'm doing so many. I messed it up. That was weird. Sorry. Dun dun. Okay, instant classic is as good as it gets with... I know, I never saw the whole thing, though. You know what's an instant classic to me? Death Becomes Her. Untamed Heart. Funny classic, Encino Man. Encino Man was a decent movie. I don't recall. I had, there was a time in my teens where I'm just like, I loved these movies. I, these movies were great. Watched Rudy all the time. Rudy was my, my favorite. School Ties, another favorite. Ugh, such good movies. Okay, but as a mom, you had to have, let's see, what about, yes. I'm not a mother, but yes. The glasses might deter that, but, hey! Fuzzled, how are you doing? I need a spoon. Good morning, Rusty. How are you? Are you just waking up? Hello. By the stops. I, I do love What About Bob. I also, I like Bill Murray. There was a long time where I loved um, Back to School with uh, Rodney Dangerfield. And Robert Downey Jr. I don't even remember the other dude's name. He could put more filling in it and it has make it look like a normal sandwich. So funny. Red Flag City. Red Flag City. Well, good morning. Good morning. Has the house not far? Nice. See, Daniel really likes that. Um, movie too. He has the book though. I, I never read the book and I never saw that movie either. And I didn't, there's a lot of movies I didn't see that everybody saw. I'm so, it's weird. Who's your celebrity crutch? Thank you, astronaut Astro. 
Astronaut. Astronaut. Are these still frozen? No. Mm-hmm. Those blueberries are delicious. Are we down here? Yeah. Okay. I love her. Who is who is your cele celebrity crush? Oh wait, John. How about it, John? He's pretty in pink. Um. 16 candles, obviously. What, what, what's the one? Hi, no, not high fidelity. What's the other one? Where he's, what, not better off dead. Is it better off dead? Where he's holding the thing above his, I don't know. Breakfast Club was pretty good, yeah. But it's not my favorite. It's not as, I mean, it's fine. But like, Yeah, I, it's not one I want to watch again and again. Like, 16 Candles, I would want to watch again and again. Just because there's so many funny little things in it. And it brings me joy. Pretty in Pink is great. What? You can't say what, who it is? Now I'm pissed. Why are you being censored? I know. Why is it being censored? It's so weird. What were they in? Pretty in pink beats. Yeah. But 16 Candles. 16 Candles is probably one of my favorite things of all time. <clears throat> that wasn't <clears throat> John Hughes though. Or was it? So bizarre you have to do that but yeah no audrey hepburn totally great that's super weird i'm just so unsatisfied how everyone forgot her throughout the movie yeah <laughs> and it was her birthday <laughs> but also <laughs> that older sister <gasps> i know I don't know. It's, it's so funny. God. <laughs> that blonde sister. It was so ditzy. God. I guess I kind of didn't realize it because I felt like that was normal. So it didn't really bum me out because I felt like it was normal. We're making muffins, though you can't tell. It's all a matter of perspective. Yeah, I love bird, the bird cage. But I also love Robin Williams. Like Patch Adams was a good one. I mean, obviously I like Mrs. Doubtfire. But I also love him in the birdcage. I think the only one I didn't really ever see him in was Good Morning Vietnam, even though I have the sound bites, and uh, Dead Poet Society. Yeah, totally loved and cried for a very, very long time and was super depressed for a very long time after he died. But no, that's not a fun topic to talk about. And it was, was it 2012? I think he died in 2012. Ugh. There. You know. 
seven years ago. Hold on. I know you're writing stuff. I can't see it yet. I will see it in just a second. And I'll scroll back up. Mm. I'm going to have to detract some of these. Ah! Yep. Okay, I overachieved with some. What are we saying? Sorry, I gotta go soon. Take care. Okay, comic. Sorry about that. I still can't. I on uh, me neither. Nathan Lane, Robin Williams. I, so good. Such a great casting. I should be fast asleep, but no. I'm, right? But I like Nathan Lane. It's all a matter of, yeah. I didn't see Insomnia. I don't think. What's the one where he's with Robert De Niro? Is that Patch Adams? Yeah, I still can't. Yeah. Mm -mm. Yes, it, mental. It's been an honor. It's been an honor, for sure. Thanks for stopping by. It was good to see you again. Feldman's, did both of the Corys die? Did Corey Feldman die too recently? I feel like he died recently. I might be wrong. And if I'm wrong, please do correct me because I hate being, you know, I don't, I don't mind being corrected. Yeah, I don't blame him either. Music from the nine days he loved best. I liked... I could tell you what I didn't like more than I could tell you what I liked because I loved everything. Most of the time though, it was 90s hip hop. Started with Bone Thugs, really into that. But if he threw some ace, and ace of bass at me, I would punch you in the face. <laughs> so, or some Wilson Phillips, I would kill you. Like all of them are dreadful. Oh, I cannot stand Ace of Ace. Yeah, no. If I hear, like, anything off of that, like, I saw the sign, oh my god. No. No, thank you. We're not even counting these. We're just going to dump them. Okay? Okay. Give me your you. So crazy. But then you can't you can't negate like Pearl Jam and Nirvana. God. Sound Garden. Temple of the Dog. Here's some great nineties alternative rock. I would say that 89 was a bizarre year. <laughs> I mean, just think about it. We still have Dave Grohl. And it brings me so much happiness. Knowing that he is still on this planet. I'm not even a huge fan of Foo Fighters. But I'm so, I, I feel so fortunate to have been able to, you know, enjoy the first band he was in to the other. Okay. But also, I'm super glad that I was the one that introduced my friends, a few of my friends, to Amy Winehouse. God, what a, what a tragedy. <sighs> so upsetting. Well, that's kind of pretty. Oh, you can't see it. You don't see the prettiness. It's just kind of neat. This is a year, dear, because I was born. 
that was the best part because I just feel like there was a lot of hair bands that were still trying to make it and they should have just been switching it up. I don't know. 89 was kind of a weird year. Oh, I'm so glad. Oh, yeah, that don't turn around. No, 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 no. Uh-uh, no. Were you the lady who wore, who would wrap to, no. No, I would just, I would sing the chorus for sure, especially if it was Aaliyah. Ugh. Um, I loved, uh, yeah. Um, what was the other? There was something else. Nope. Because I was too busy bopping around in my car, like. I wasn't going to... I do sing, and I will sing some Band of Forces in my car and some Pearl Jam and some Radiohead in my car, no problem. Who's the other one? Who's the other one? Sturgill Simpson. I will sing Sturgill Simpson in my car. Yes, I was. She was my favorite, mm, second favorite performer at the at the uh, Alicia Keys, Beyonce, Missy Elliott show I saw. You know, um, years and years ago, they were on the, the same ticket, and Alicia Keys was amazing. Of course, she was amazing. Who's what? <gasps> Happy belated birthday, Christine. I'm sorry. Thank you for thank you for deleting that. They're not cute, but they're gonna be delicious, and we know they're gonna be delicious. Fifteen minutes. Happy belated. You know, I can't remember if I'm, I forget that I'm 44 and that I'm going to be 45. I forget that all the time. Oh shoot. I have to work on that. That's not, that's not beneficial to everyone. Also, I have to look at my license because I think I have to get my license renewed. Twenty minutes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, we've we've had enough politics in here, man. I can't. We can't do it. <laughs> I love me some politics. I will talk politics till I'm blue in the face. Am I when I'm in my studio? Really, no topic. It's really off the table. Um, and I will hear anybody's opinion, but they have to hear mine. But most people don't want to hear my opinion, so they don't get to tell me theirs. <laughs> he tells me about life in the 70s and we vibe so well. Nice. Painter, and he's a famous painter, so it was fun with me. Yeah. I still don't know how I got stuck thinking I was the same age that long. Are you in a time time warp? You're in a time warp. Yeah, you can have five people in an age. Quick 
guy. Hi, Shane. How are you? Get out of here. <laughs> it's good to see you. Hello. We're okay. We're all just, we've got things going on. We've got pumpkin seeds. We've got blueberry muffins in the thing. I want to eat some frozen custard. I have enough cookies and it'll bring me back to doing the thing tomorrow. Maybe you were abducted. I'm so happy everybody's here. Welcome. Ooh. We are. Ugh. Jiffy. <clears throat> Those are delicious. Yep. What do you think when I say the remembered future? Hmm. What do I think when I say <clears throat> the remembered future? I think of the story that you plan on telling in the future of what the past is about. I don't know. I don't know who that is. I will never be old. Nope. Our souls. Nope. They live here, Jim. They've been living here this whole time. Haven't you ever seen the abyss? What is the right answer though? Is that, what's your answer? We click too because we don't, I, I love you guys for that. Hmm. What do you mean, nope? Labyrinth with freaking, I, what, me? I love Labyrinth, are you kidding? Labyrinth is great. Although the dark crystal is better. If we're going to talk about Jim Henson movies, I mean, Labyrinth is great. You have to be in the mood for one and not the other. But also I have a thing with, I was watching that video game Bramble, and one of the characters, Tuva, looks like a gelfling, and I'm just, I, I, I love it so much. The thing he does with the glass ball and his, I know, I know, I wanted to do that so bad. Um, two, two dogs, one cat permanently, and then one that comes in. It's a theory. I believe we can remember certain things in the future. Time isn't linear. Right? The thing he does with it. Yeah. I don't know how any of you ladies to do it. I don't. You get really good at letting things go over your head. Fortunately, I'm dwelling on something else usually, so I don't even notice. I know, but I like to think that it isn't linear. Because if you ever see his dark materials, it's kind of like where that is in my brain. Wasn't as good as Black Sabbath, but I still stay in him. Okay. Did I set the timer? Please tell me I set the timer. I did. Sweet. Seven minutes. Oh, my subathon is over. But also, I wanted to see if I can be on here for a little while. Einstein proved it isn't. We don't know. He knows now. Yeah, he can prove that, but didn't he also explain wormholes? I started just saying. I just like thinking of things like that. He was a good human being. Who would win? Lemmy. <laughs> I subscribed to the Socrates School of Thought. Well, now I need to know what that one is. 
I, I think I knew, but I'm not sure. I've been talking a lot about religion and afterlife this week. Yeah, we don't know what we don't know. It's your question, let me ask God. I, Maybe in your, your version. I like to think that the pillars of creation is where God lives. Oh, nice. Trick question. Oh, yes. I have no idea what you're referring to, and I'm atheist AF. <laughs> See, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, um, I just don't believe that the cut and dryness of either a reference to airheads. I never saw it. Oh. But I I can see the characters. I can see the actors on the on the uh, cassette tape on the cover. I can't see the movie. I have never seen the movie. You're missing out though, Chris. With a fascist and elitist. <sighs> Fuzzled we're keeping a pretty clear vibe. That may be, but it doesn't mean he didn't say things that were useful. Right. Fuzzle, we're trying to keep a vibe, please. Freud was a total, yeah, right? Nietzsche, do you wanna talk about Nietzsche? Nietzsche? I'm not saying that right. Frederick Nietzsche. Nietzsche. Oof. I only know anything about him because I never read any of his stuff. But I only know about him because of Natalie Wynn. I love me some Natalie Wynn, man. Forever. Agnostic is a reasonable meaning. I don't know what I don't know. Right. Down to earthy. Yes. It's fun. Carl Jung is great. Is it, even I'm, you are. You are, Jim, thank you for that. Nietzsche said life without music would be a mistake. So, yeah, we have to like him for that. But have you ever watched um, ContraPoints? She has one on that. Give me a Citizen Kane though and I'd be the happiest. What? Home Alone proves you wrong. <laughs> music is math. And I was always bad at math, and I can't read music. Which is the worst, honestly. Wasn't at least for sure, because that's the way society, yeah. Planted the seed for the tyrant. Hence corrupting the youth. I mean, but... You guys, everything was so askew. Everything we learn is askew. I don't trust anything, really. We had to find our own opinions. And don't shit on somebody else's opinion. God, just because it's different than yours. Mike, you can still... Yeah, no. Please, Danya. I'm gonna fly out the handle. I think I did it. I think these are over. Okay. Ow. I'm not making cookies. I made those things. I prefer painting as painting is the purest expression of... Yes. But so is sculpting. But painting, yeah. I can, I could see that. Gracias, Carlos. Sculptors are too elitist in my opinion. I'm a sculptor. 
but I just have a different medium. I don't. Also, they're always so freaking nice and cut. It's infuriating. <laughs> My husband um, used to paint and draw and all that. He just he doesn't anymore. <clears throat> These are making me choke. What? He's being funny. Yeah, and he doesn't paint anymore. Probably because he's tired, but also I think he's just... He's too happy. Baby boy. Bye bye. Are you okay? You're not feeling well, are you? Hmm. Stop. I love me some Bob Ross. Yeah, but he. I think he needed that. That was his therapy. He was in therapy when he was doing that. Oh. See, I, I can't have that. He is. Some jokes are okay. That one wasn't bad. It's not, it wasn't pervy. It was just being sarcastic. Man, I wish I liked poetry more than I don't know. Like, so I married an ox murder. That coffee shop scene where she's saying a poem. It's super long. It's just not. That's not enjoyable to watch. But, you know who is enjoyable to watch? Eminem. Kurt! Cab, it's so good to see you. Are you, you're going to bed? Sorry, I was eating my, what is my problem? I almost called them potatoes. It's, it doesn't make any sense. It doesn't rhyme, it's a crime. It, right? It kind of feels that way. It just it messes me up. Like, I like stories. I bet these are done. I have to go get them out. What were you eating? Um, pumpkin seeds. But, yeah, some of them are better than others. Haikus are fun. When my husband and I first started seeing each other, we would sit at the bar and write haikus to each other. It's just fun. Jim, I recommend it.
There's a lot of maintenance. But man, that's any house, right? You know, people can live in a tiny house. Why not have it be in water? Of course I remember you, Kev. Right. Musicians. I, I wish I I wish I could read music actually. I like to think that I could sing. I can voice match. I can voice match. Um oh my god, what is my problem? Tom York. Good morning, mister. How are you? But I wish I could voice match Grace Slick. Can't. Well, Jim, that's, a, that's an issue. You want to have good luck. I gotta get these buckles out. Ugh. Why are you so heavy? Knock it off. Only slightly overdone and it's only 4.30. I know, I know. There is lots of maintenance, but with any house, right? I think. Those smell amazing. I cannot wait. I have to clean this up. You guys, I've been doing this for a long time. How long have I been on? Oh, nice. Two hours and a, two and a half hours. That is so nice. Man. That is so great. I gotta get off of here, you guys. Just got finished baking a peach cobbler. It's the best. I I have peach cobbler make supplies and I haven't made them. I need to. No, three and a half, I think, was my personal record. And I made a blackberry cobbler. Speaking of cobblers. Hi, Christian. What's up with you? Um... How was your peach cobbler? Do you put Do you put the biscuit or the cobbler, the batter, whatever, in first, like after the butter, and then put the peaches on top, or do you put the batter on top of the peaches? That's a whole thing I didn't know that was a problem. I didn't know. I do it like whenever I've made it before, I do the uh, the batter first after the butter. Never mind. I just had a bad Halloween. Maybe tomorrow I'll celebrate Halloween. Yeah, I hope you have a good night. You have a good night, Stars Moon. Christian, it's okay. Before you go, please listen to the band called Flipped him. You guys are making me do all these. Greta Flynn Fleet is fine. Not my favorite. But that's it. I can't get off of here. This is the most few viewers I've had in like, I don't know, a month. Batter on top of the peaches. No, you gotta put the batter on the bottom, on top of the butter, right? And then put the peaches on top and then it floats to the top. And then you got a cobbler. So good. But yeah, I'll make it one day, but it takes forever. It takes like an hour and a half or whatever. It's stupid. But I am going to do it once. Because I, I can. Always has to be have that crumble on top. I know and it, com it, it comes to the top. Oh wait, you're talking about the crumble though? Like an apple cop? No. 
How was your Halloween? Did you do anything? Passed out um, candy to one group of kids and set everything up for um, the hair thing. But um, what is the other thing? Yeah. Um, what else? I feel like I did a bunch of other stuff and I just can't recall what it was now. My brain stopped working. I'm, olives are amazing. I'll just start calling you Kratos, Jim. Do you know who Kratos is? Ow. My brain stopped working. This isn't what I wanted, but this is what we're doing. Ah. No. Kratos is a Greek god. He's in a video game. And things that he wishes he could eat is, um, like, things that he craves are olives. And this other character, Mimir, is like, what the hell's an olive? And it was funny. I love olives. I love uh, Castavit... Kes Castle Vetrano. Castle Vetrano. Look how bright green they look on the camera. Fantastic. Salt, salt. It's the closest my generation comes to old rock. You think? Because I kind of feel like that with the... Me too. I'm eating some right now. Um, who was it? Who was it? I feel like Courtney Barnett is the same. Or gin, uh, my morning jacket, band of horses. Those are old rock. I wasn't able to pass candy out this year. I usually work until 11.30 at night. Aww. Did you have enough candy, Christian? I'm sorry. Those These are it. They're so good. Take a screenshot. Mm hmm. Nice. Me too. Cap, me too. That was a big year for trick-or-treaters where I was living too. I live in a place where you just don't have a lot of trick-or-treaters. Busy road and everything. You guys, I really do. I have to get off of here. I have to clean up and enjoy my muffins and wash my face and go to bed. I took my first shower that I today since Friday. Yeah. So it'd been a while. I'm glad I did it. It's great. Olives are a bit salty, but I can manage. I like me some salt, though. I did this, um, when you're supposed to die thing, and it said 67. It's like, perfect. 
I, it's in my drafts. I thought about posting it, but I'm like, it's kind of depressing. Um, but yeah. Okay. Bye, you guys. It was good seeing you guys. Bye.